Oh, hey, a new teleport slime popped up. Rainbow River. I think is this. Uh, yeah, this seems to be the only path forward. I don't plan on doing the bonus dungeons until I'm at the end of the game, when I actually have all the stuff I need for it. Anything else I might want to keep an eye on in here? There's a missile down there. Hmm. Oh yeah, if you end up using an, uh, uh, one of your summons up for crafting or for a quest, you have to recapture them. Which could be difficult if, they're, if they are really rare mobs that don't respawn. Hopefully it doesn't come down to that too often. Rainbow River, is that near Anna's hometown? I can't go through here until I get some kind of axe. So what exactly is our plan of action now? Well, we can't cross the water to the south a southern continent yet. We get swept away by the currents and we try to swim. We need to find some other way around it. Oh, I know. We need to find a raft. People at Hope Harbor use them all the time. But we didn't see any rafts when we were there. They were all scuttled by huge waves when the meteor hit, I think. The only guy that knows how to make them ironically lives across the river. At the edge of the Mystic Woods. You're talking about the Raft Maker, yeah? That's where he lives, and we can get there if we go west from Greenwood Village. Yeah, let's head there then. Where's Greenwood? Is it north of here? Yes! Alright guys, we're almost at Greenwood Village. This is my home, so don't you dare try anything funny, okay? Lance, you should try to look as sorry as possible so that you're not lynched for your crimes. Like this? Hmm, maybe. Man, no legs, I've got that you're a bunch of filthy thieves. So don't even try stealing anything from my village. My reputation travels fast. Offended by accusations. Welcome to Greenwood Village. Fascists not welcome though. Hey, I can s talk to it from across the fence. You guys defeated the fascists? Thank God, Cat. I thought I'd be forced to hold them off on my own. This town's been besieged by fascists on one end and monsters on the other. Hey, why is there a leader with you? I've been shamefully forced to retire. I'm no longer your enemy. How do I get across there? I guess I have to go in from the other side. What's in here? A red pill. How I uh, yeah, it's it increases in accuracy for some reason. Maybe uh, uh, those are disturbing implications. Here's the public library. If you ever have some time to read about in-depth spell strategies, this is the place to do it. They've also got the only computer in the whole town. What kind of backwards town is this? East weapon shop, northeast crafting item and food shops, just over there, steroid stall. Huh, these are probably too expensive for me right now, but they do give me a, a, a nice option for dealing with those uh, uh, those scaling enemies. Also, I think scale, do scaling enemies drop items still? If they do, you could technically farm those items and then sell them, and then just use that to farm stat boosting stuff until you're way too strong for them, maybe. Lance, my love, you come to be with me again. I've missed you greatly. Oh, it's this one again. I think I gave her the wrong idea when I kidnapped her. She might be soft in the head. I fantasize about you every moment of every day. You're so brave and wonderful. Being apart only makes me yearn for you even more. Look, girl, I only need you for your childbearing capabilities. There is and never was any love between us. And since my plan was aborted prematurely, you are nothing to me. Please don't sue me for my crimes. Ah, oh, playing hard again, are we? That's okay. I'm sure you'll find your way back to me eventually. I'll be watching you from afar. Always. Ew. Indeed. If you take anything from here, I'll make sure you bring it back. But you're the one in control right now. Curly horns. Oh, 
Oh, I can ma- Oh no, I'm running out of coffee! But the resistances are just too good. It also improves my chances of catching foes, so... It is pretty tempting. Potato. Okay, there's an achievement for reading every book in the library. Katamari? So many books! This is heaven! This is hell! I'm bored already! Hey! They still have discs here! Coffee and apple. How many more discs do I need? Two more. And I still need to find a fishing rod and sunglasses. I need to find a titanium. Oh, visitor! Welcome to Greenwood Library! We've got books on everything you'd ever need to know. If you want details about battle mechanics or other stuff? Feel free to browse our collection. Our monster hunting series is particularly impressive. And I think I'm fine just saying things and seeing what happens. Don't be rude, Matt. We could really use this opportunity to study and prepare ourselves. There's a lot you won't be able to figure out with just brute force. That's true. A lot of people playing Doctrine Rebirth figure, uh, thought they could figure things out on the road, including me. And everyone, including me, probably got their asses kicked really hard, even by the normal enemies. It looks like someone's been studying an old legend. It says that three spiritual stones exist somewhere in this world, which may activate a portal to another world. No one alive today knows what lies within this mysterious world. I think I have one of those. The Sapphire of Dreams. Trust in dreams, for in them is hidden the gate to eternity. Hello. Hey, you're on the quest, right? Have you had a look at the options menu lately? Just a friendly reminder that you can make the game easier or harder at any time and change all sorts of our preferences. I like the option that protects my modesty, but I'm probably the only one. Sigh. The cleavage one. This is what she looks like, nor uh, without uh, with cleavage unchecked, huh? I've read every book here, but there's not much point since they're all about fighting, and I rolled some terrible stats at birth. I'd be killed instantly in a real fight. Oh well, there's more to life than just fighting monsters. I'm kind of jealous of you, Anna, but damn, you brought back some weird friends this time. Yeah, they're pretty weird, all right. I hope being weird is the worst thing they get caught doing. Please don't talk to me. I'm just taking a quick break to regenerate my concentration. I need to get back to studying soon. A computer... So what What kind of battle tips do they have? Some status effects can be crippling against certain foes. Many stronger foes resist the worst effects, but not always. Check if a strong foe can be affected by with death or siphon, for example. There may be a simple way to immobilize a powerful foe. There also exists equipment that can improve chances of status effects working. The good and bad luck status effects also modify chances. Many status effects have synergy with each other. Yeah, this is a pretty complex game in terms of status effects. Unlike pre previous Epic Ball Fantasy games, buffs don't stack in this game. It, don't, it always goes to a fixed value. For example, 50% buff given to a player of an existing 20% buff will only result in 50%. This makes the buffs very dangerous, as they can easily cancel out buffs. However, that also means you can use a buff to cancel out a debuff. However, it also exists equipment that improves buff skills, which can lead to some enormous buffs. Many advantages to switching your allies during battle. Switching does not cost a turn. Players in backup positions will be automatically healed. Players in backup may have better buffs. If active players have been debuffed or dispelled, switching players frequently allows you to use skills with cooldowns more often. We're going to take a break from playing video games every hour or so. Prolonged sitting can lead to hemorrhoids and early death even in real life. You should also try to eat a vegetable occasionally, and remember not to look directly at the sun. Skill combos can greatly multiply damage, and are worth setting up more often than not. In two turns you can buff your main character, debuff the foe's defense, Apply a status effect that improves il elemental damage, freeze or stagger the foes, and hit them with your strongest attack or two. All of these together multiply the damage exponentially. 
This is especially useful before using limit breaks or other powerful attacks. Yeah, that's pretty much how you... Uh, I've been playing a lot of games that pretty much expect you to do stuff like that. Some foes that may exhibit intelligent behavior. They might avoid targeting your resistances. This is, they may be even better on, at this on harder difficulties. A skill's damage... Uh, keep in mind where a skill is magic or physical. So all players are more effective with one stat than the other, and equips and buff enhance them separately. Most foes have equal defense against both, but some are weaker than one type of damage compared to the other. Bestiary and foe will show you this. Some skills when it comes to enemy attacks are not 100% elemental. I should really skip the rest of this since it can be easily looked up elsewhere. Okay, I got the bookworm medal for reading all of these. Off screen, of course. Bonus skills. Yeah, the good thing about the bonus skills in this game is that you can move you can move them to other players without losing their levels. But it's pretty hard to come uh, to to decide who you want to put the skill on. Okay, I'm pretty sure I talked to everyone here, and that's all the items too. You know, it's kind of strange they put all the information about battle mechanics in the in the middle of the game and not at the beginning. Or or at least this kind of information you think would be in the info section so that players can look it up at any time. Not in the in a town where you'd actually have to know all this stuff already just to get here. On epic mode at least. Turnip, pumpkin. Oh no! I need left and right sock. I don't have those anymore. Hey Anna, have you noticed doing side quests is good? How you get new bonus skills? Monsters killed by scarecrow, and I got to build a new one. I'm just asking for a few bits of cloth, really. Where the hell am I supposed to get these? Probably in someone's house. I better just ro continue trying to rob them. Oh, a real grumpy g guy lives over there. I leave him alone. He's probably hiding a dark secret. I recognize you! What, you again? Are you guys the neighborhood watch or something? Why are you making my life hard? Like I said, I'm innocent. We haven't accused you of anything yet. But your clothes make you look a, a tad suspicious. Ah, nice. Grumpy guy. Oh, uh, who the hell are you? You think you're just walking to people's houses? Get the hell out of here! Relax, old man. We are, uh, the tax man. We just need to take a few things. <laughs> Taxes. Stick around. You might find out what we do of your kind around here. A GameCube. I think this one was called the Gamebox 720. Never got a chance to play it, but I hear Mega Whack Bros is a pretty good game. <coughs> <coughs> Just steal some food. What? Oh no, you're not one of these cultists, aren't you? Oh hell nah. Oh, but I meant to take your sock. The great door shall open to those who purify their souls under the gates of the destroyer. Only a blood only blood and darkness can wash away the grave sins of this mortal world. Sins must be Cleanse from the soul like tearing meat from the bone. An offering of flesh is required. Bald milk and energy drink. Raw beef. Hard nut. <coughs> Toilet. <coughs> Newspaper. Okay. Let's look for more of these stupid cultist guys. I'm sure they're down here with their stupid treasures. Yep, I knew it. Oh, a secret cavern? There's no way anything innocent is happening down here. Oh, come on. I guess I'm not going to do anything with this area.
Oh well, I need to get the bridge item and then I can go rob that place. Let's explore the rest of town. There's supposed to be a weapon shop. Why are bushes in this town? You guys are horrible at this. So you guys are horrible at security. There's a lot of new houses being built, as you can see. The people of Greenwood used to live in hollowed out trees not long ago, but I guess times are changing. Wooden plank. Damn monsters took my wooden planks. I'm just trying to build me a house like an honest dude. And I have to deal with this crap? I don't even know how to swing a sword or nothing. I'm doomed to suffer. Where am I gonna get all these wooden planks? Okay, steroids. Grab this steel plate. Blacksmith, shoplifters not welcome, we're watching you. Let the white teachings of the prophet into your hearts and God Cat's angels br shall bring you eternal good fortune. Book of Caddis. How strong are these pushes? This one actually looks kind of strong. But I don't have to hold back because they're not... Because these guys are, have already been captured at least once. Okay. Let's try to do a magic... Let's try magic. Buff Lance. Skill. Flame Burst. Ow. Seems, it feels way too peaceful for battle music. Hop out. You shall buff no legs. No legs, let's see. Wind! Wind is the way to go here. Surrender! Captured! Confirm! Now I can go back here and... That accomplished nothing. How do I get back there? Oh no! I see, maybe I need to... I may need to help him build his house first, maybe then that'll allow him to clear the way and allow me to get to the chest. Yes, that's clearly it. No use fighting these monsters at other than for grinding. <coughs> so this is the village armory? They barely have any weapons or armor! How did they resist my attacks for so long? Were my men really so useless? Coral Key. These remind me of a game I used to play. It was supposed to be the final one, but that was a lie. I never got past the imps anyway. Huh. I saw what you did! Huh? I ain't done nothing. What's your problem, man? I saw you stealing scrap metal from our workbench outside. You can't lie to me. Unclaimed items don't belong to anyone. They're only yours if they're in your inventory. Wrong! In Greenwood, we have property laws to defend against paid crooks like yourself. We're not going to prosecute you for a small bit of steel, but we will increase our shop prices just for you. Maybe you'll, you'll learn a lesson here. I will never change my ways. Wait, are you serious? We're going to increase prices? Sigh. I didn't see that coming. Panties. Headband. How about socks? I hope these aren't made from real fur. I don't want to support a business that kills cute animals. June is the love of my life. I got to know her by spying through her window for several months. I think things are really going to take off between us. I just need to convince her that I'm a nice guy and a loyal feminist ally. Rock? You mean Brock. Oh dear, poor June. Nurse Joy. This creep keeps bringing me junky finds, like a cat or something. 
He seems to always know where I'm gonna be. Maybe he works for Google or something. Time to delete all of my social media accounts, I guess. Looks like every girl has to deal with someone really creepy, eh? Huh? Why are you looking at me? Wait, you saw the same stuff as the other equipment shop. Ellie's didn't <coughs> try to mark me up. But still. Alright, should I buy both? Giant Slayer. Look, n almost no accuracy. Alchemist Bow. Ram status effects. Could be useful for taming animals. Viking Buckler seems pretty bad. Why is there a bush hanging up on the corner here? They're level 27 for some reason. Okay, turns out being all these green bushes around here is necessary to get these wooden planks, but there's also they're also pretty damn strong. Holy crap. <clears throat> How am I going to hit them? I may have to rely on poison. Let's see, equip Anna a little better. I don't really have a whole lot of weapons for you, do I? Hmm. Let's try this again. I really wish I could buff their <laughs> accuracy somehow. There we go. Okay. Oh, wait, let's combo shot. Poison. More poison! This is pretty much how we had to. Uh, this is. I think, what, uh, I think I had to do this one time on Epic Wild Fantasy 3. Poison a really high level bush, since it was easier than trying to actually damage it directly. Overgrowth! Finishings off by using um piercing shot. There, give me the plank. Now I can. Now I managed to complete this quest. Got annihilate. Attack with a chance of instantly killing all foes does not work well on bosses and has low accuracy. I should probably give that to Anna. Since she has high accuracy. Oh, sweet man, you gonna give me this wood? You're a real lifesaver. I can finally finish my house. In return, I'll tell you about this cool ninja kill move I saw on TV. Now I need to leave and come back so that he can finish building his house. Oh, yes, a fire elemental gun. And some foods. Please tell me I can forge this. Okay, level three's not bad. So lo let me use his flame skill, I guess. Flame burst. I really need to farm some more AP off screen. Let's go inside his house and see what's in it. Yo, riches dudes, I couldn't have built this house without ya. You. you can rob me blind now if you like, you've earned it. Seriously, don't mind what I do. He knows I'm gonna rob him. But, oh well. Treasure. How many more music CDs do I need? I can go back to the Iron Fortress now. Yo, know, I shouldn't have looked in there. Floppy and Herb. 
What a beautiful work of art. It really captures the artist's personality and message while leaving some space for interpretation. It looks like a piece of bread. Socks? No, just panties. Curses. Any secret passages I need to be aware of? Maybe Anna has a sock in her house. What does this sign say again? Okay. Whoa, I see a something here. Oh, I can't... There's nothing over here. Um, oh, this is the Iron... F this is right next to the Iron Fortress. Okay, north then. Over to, there to the west is the entrance to the Mystic Woods. We'll need an axe again there, and I've got one at home. Strange things have been happening in there lately. People are wandering off and appearing later as, uh, undead monsters. They're attacking the village quite often now. So obviously, we have to go in there and investigate, right? You, w you would do that for me? You're a brave and virtuous ally, Matt. Yeah, totally. I'm really getting into this helping people thing. As long as we're not up against ghosts. Well, we also need to find the raft maker who lives in those woods. Plus, from the sounds of it, there's a few more items in there that should be helpful. North Anna's house in Redgate Shrine. Mystic Woods currently cursed. Travel not recommended. I broke a mirror and was cursed with bad luck, but the thing is, I could have sworn it was floating towards me, as if it were alive. The weirdest monsters are coming out of the woods these days. Some backup would be nice. Hey. You guys are heading into the Mystic Woods? I advise against that unless you know what you're doing. It's a labyrinth in there. We need to find the raft maker and going through the woods is the only way. But more importantly, I want to protect my home from monsters. I trust you, Anna, but th these other guys you're with look a bit clueless. Eh? Well, anyway, the woods contain two important treasures that will allow you to reach the Wrath Maker's camp. Keep your eyes peeled for them, and good luck. Oh, and don't let the walking trees get you. Walking trees? There's no such thing as walking trees. She's just trying to scare us. Ah, the shop. Ice... A, a puzzle. Oh, shoot. I need to get the axe for that. <clears throat> this is my favorite shop because I just love all the plants. Beautiful cacti, precious fungi, and tasty herbs. Maybe I'll start my own collection someday. I can steal something from here. Anna is stealing from her own people. How do I get back there? Is there a secret passage? Huh. There's the left sock. Yeah! I'm gonna call the guards! Burglar! Burglar! Ranja! Please forgive my rude companions. They can't control themselves. We don't mean any harm. We're sorry. Standard foods. Hopefully th they have more available here. Really need to upgrade some of my gear to level 5 if possible. Cactus! Okay, that seems to be all I can steal for now. Time to go to Anna's house and hope I have enough keys to get everything. Anything else here worth stealing? <clears throat> well, here's home. I can't believe I brought back such sketchy company. Oh dear, I'll probably have to introduce you to my parents. You still live with your parents? How old, are you? How old are you anyway? I'm a cartoon. I'm however old you want me to be. That's convenient. Hey Anna, meet my boy new boyfriend, Link. I'm making him learn to hunt so he can get me all the goodies. There's a lot, lot, there's a lot of treasure in the woods, you know. 
And his name doesn't look very good. Are you sure you're not just stressing him out by expecting too much from him? He'll leave you if you work him too hard. <laughs> no way. Link loves me unconditionally. He'll do anything for me without question. Just try not to get him killed. He's still a newbie with that bow. Hey. Ocarina, play tunes and manipulate time. The team doesn't have any musical talent, though. My heart's not really into this whole archery thing. I'd rather be making music, but Sarah's a demanding girl. Maybe she's not the one for me. Why is there an enemy here? What? Why? I should hold off on this until... What's the catch? Why is there one lone enemy there? It's not even blocking any chests. There's something back here. This is my secret personal stash. You can borrow this stuff for now. Cookie and chili pepper. How many copper keys do I have? Only three? Shoot, I must have missed one somewhere. What a strange console. It seems to operate on weird frisbees. They look quite scratched too. Hat F. Leafy hair clip. Staff paper fan. Boost wind damage. Seriously, where's all the copper keys? Some fruit. Anna, you're back! Stop wandering off like that! Will you and your friends be joining us for dinner? Now we got somewhere we need to be. We're trying to save the world from evil monoliths, actually. Not that you would believe me. Well, play safely. I love you, dear. I love you, too. Don't patronize me in front of my team. What's going on here? Is this a normal family? Many herbs can be grown right at home, and carrots and turnips are great garden vegetables. They don't require any specialized farming supplies. All that is needed is a few seeds, which can be acquired cheaply. Growing one's own produce will save a lot of money in the long term. The axe is mine. Peanut. <clears throat> hey, are these your new buddies, Anna? They've, they got a look of trouble about them. Come talk to me if they try to force you to do anything dangerous. They're mostly fine. You don't have to worry about anything. I'll keep them in line. So which one's the boyfriend? Is this a homeless tramp or a school shooter? You what, mate? I ain't shot no school yet. <coughs> yeah, we're going now. See you later, Dad. This is our balcony. As you can see, it's falling apart and needs some work. We won't be able to cross these gaps until we find a stepladder. There's always more items to find, eh? Can we just jump across? Nope. You have a dungeon near in your own house, seriously. Bo uh, a symbol of inevitable decay. And that's all I can get for now, huh? That was an interesting atmosphere. Not at all what I expected. You got something to complain about? For once, no. I grew up without any parents, so that was a new experience for me. Hey, what happened to them? If you don't mind me asking. Hmm. That's a lot of ellipses. Well, I never met my mom, and my dad died in a minecrafting accident. He was an ass, so I was better off without him. Oh, that's really crappy. Can I blame all of my shortcomings on my unfortunate upbringing now? No chance, Buster. Pretending to be a victim is unsightly. Okay, now I can do this puzzle here. There used to be another forest called Ashwood in this area, but you know, it burned down and stuff. All the bamboo spr uh, sprouted up in this place, though. Huh. Another difficult looking puzzle.
Hmm. How should I go about this? Move this here. Here. Hmm. Hold on. Like this. There we go. Flare Silver Cross. That was a mimic. This squid certainly ain't no kid. It's a big the house. Look at it. Scan. Level 21. I can probably take it. I'm gonna need some water resist and electric attacks. Take on any more enemies. Let's try to explore this area. These statues were built to commemorate the heroes that protected the village during the Great Goblin Raids. So that's a bit of history for ya. Yawn. He says I'm the greatest hunter in the village, so I'll have a statue built for me someday too. <clears throat> There's a chest back here. Hey! We're not trespassing. There's no fence around this part, so don't even try to accuse me of committing a crime. Flare Golden Pendant. <clears throat> More treasure. Let's see. This could be difficult. I vaguely remember this puzzle from the demo. Hmm. Basically, I have to get all of these X's down, huh? Do they have to be in this specific order? Okay, let's give it a try. Hmm. Where can I push you? I push it this way. This one can only go up. That's the middle one. Hmm. You walk on the rocks. Go this side, push here. Am I overthinking this on, on, in terms of the recommended order? Hmm. Well, I should be able to get them all lined up now. Yes! Yes, the Heaven's Gate! A holy elemental sword! It's usually supposed to be one of the first weapons he gets. Usually. It's everything on this screen, huh? Alright, now back to this. Killing the squid. Okay, I managed to isolate the squid. No legs, go attack it. Goes on pretty quickly. And I'm on epic mode too. Hmm. Siphon. Let 
Let's see. Blessed Barrage. If I can get enough sass effects on you, you're screwed. You're a filthy tentacles up on me, you creep. Hmm. It's hard to stack stuff on you. Tired. Now let's see if this is enough. Yes! The pink squid is mine! That was a fake chest. But it was a worthy opponent. Easter egg. Foes only drop these when they're ovulating, which is once per year. And now for this mysterious looking cat. Cat ninjas? I never caught one yet. Hmm. Okay, let's see if he can actually kill them all. Whoops! Let's actually undo that. That was a... No, actually, this is okay. Now? Now I can... I can still... I still have a chance to get them. But seriously, they die really quick, don't they? Hmm. Almost makes me wonder if I can just... Smack, the, uh, smack them with a box and still catch them. Nope. Ow. Berserk. Morale. Ah. Good. Healing. Go! Piercing shot. Whoops, that was a kill. Anything I do could tr could kill them, huh? Box them. Yes. Cat Ninja is mine. Oh, good thing that missed, otherwise no legs would have died. Alright, I'll finish off the spell, I'll be right back. Alright, push this block out of the way, and... I was hoping for a copper key. And I see a doll here that I have to kill real quick. Be right back. Okay, what's in here? Raw beef, magma chunk, and amber. There. What's to the north? A new area? Shrines like these are supposed to ward off evil and give you good luck when you pray. I'm skeptical about it, but it's a fun tradition. My boobs aren't growing no matter how much I pray. Ciao. Oh no, I have to give him a bunch of slimes. And it's holding Slime Bunny, the, my regen source. You there, you know, you look like you know how to tame monsters. I need some punching backs to practice against, but I need something that won't die when I cut parts off. Do you know of any such beasts? I'll train them to be the best punching bags ever. But all this is for the sake of getting a new skill. Advanced Wind Skill hits a single target, makes targets lighter. Ah, uh, Slimes, but of course. The next time we meet, I'll have trained these hideous beasts in the Beautiful punching bags. Hmm. Orbs. I also need some way to walk on these lily pads. Hmm. What's this enemy? 
A bear? Oh no, that's a lot of them. Bears are usually calm until you do something stupid to tick them off. So here goes nothing. Level 21. Power of the enemy guarding these chests. The Celtic Cross. <clears throat> Butterfly wings fight for in Rainbow War. And then this cat here is guarding something. But what? We're on the map, are we? Right here, the upper right corner. There's nothing to the north of this. It's the end of the world. Oh no. Hmm. Okay, this one. Emerald and Cactus. And that's it for the shrine for now. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else I can grab here. Until I can get a raft or some way to walk on lily pads. <clears throat> okay, I think I have a quest for you. Reflex, yes. Evasion for everyone. Yes, a chest right here behind this tree. Might as well just chop down everything here while I'm at it. Give you your quest items. Now I have the power metal skill. Perfect, this is excellent. Time to start my perfectly legitimate business. I'll offer the most authentic CDs out there. No scam at all. A chest here. Lollipop. Anything else? Hmm. We also have to go. Hope Harbor. Hmm. Where the hell does this lead? Well, man, let's explore this guy's house. Hopefully it won't turn to one of those horror levels again. Golden Ticket. Like a bird. Pop-Tart <laughs> and chocolate. <laughs> See if it doesn't even work. There's never anything good on anyway. Hmm. This place is kind of creepy. I see another push puzzle. Hmm. Sunglasses. And fishing rod. Okay. Is that it? I feel like there's. Is this guy connected to the cult as well? Hmm. Okay, now he gave me the lock-on skill to buff accuracy. Energy drink and bow. Cheers, Matt, you're the best. Glad I'm wiping the light to see the mess down there. That was pretty ordinary. Check out this area. There's a glitch here. But the question is, am, am I at the right level? Hey, is this a secret level? This is awesome. But something feels a bit strange here. Why does a place like this even exist? Now.
It loops. These guys look a little... What is that? Why does it have such high defenses? How do I catch it? I need to rethink my, re my strategy. I know I, I want to catch it no matter what, even though it looks way too sh powerful. Level 23. Looks like I can take it. Buff, no legs. Let's see. Water Whirl. Splash is opposed to the grace of, bleached, of a beached whale. Hmm. Firestorm. Ah! It's pretty. Oh shit, they are really strong. Uh, but I need to catch one at least. Despite their weird mechanics. Hmm. Eruption. Uh oh. Coffee. I really need to remember to buy more. Tired. Capture. Yes. Wait, capturing it won't cause any problems, will it? Fire. Hmm. Barrier. I played enough Super Meat Boy to see where this is going. Hmm. Gah. Blessed Barrage. Catch! These guys are really tough. Oh my... Yikes! Confusion? Do I have that size effect? Hmm. Ow. Duh. This is really bad. Water whirl. Poisoning or burning it might work. Uh. Apex.
Let's see. Is there any way to weaken you? Wispy. Oh no! Revive! Okay. Swap in Anna. Tired! How oh, she aim free shots so perfectly? Huh. Ah. Matt, unleash. Burns, yes. This could take a while. Gah. Almost there. Hey, even though it... Okay, now I can capture you. That was dangerous. We got a lot of experience, too. Heavy Claw. Something's there. First, I need to kill this pixel. Hmm. This is getting really rough. Uh, damn it, Lance, don't say that. Uh. Now what? Pose that thing, is that a... I've never seen that one before. Let's scan it real quick and then retreat. Something's not right here. How do I tame it? Then how can we tell? Apparently I have to use elemental attacks after all. Hmm, but I didn't manage to catch it, so that kind of sucks. Okay, so this boss here, it can basically one-shot you anytime it pleases. Alright, first let's have you show up. So anyways, first, uh, taming it can be quite difficult. Yeah. If you want to tame it, you're better off, you'll have to bring a lot of copies and try to have Anna st uh, just tap the boss with her bow until it's sparable. I'll do that off screen. Yep, just like in the previous game, one hit kill. It also has an area version of that attack, so bring lots of copies and try to have your backup party members alive. Hot 
did it somehow! Unbelievable! So, um... What do I do with it? It costs 99 and... I don't think I should actually use it. What does this do? I mean, I caught it for the sake of completionism, but... I'm not sure this was the right thing. At least I got the box symbol, and that's all that matters. Weird. I hope this didn't screw me over. Huh. Very weird. You know what, I'm just- I should just head out. Ah! What the hell? Everything's back to normal now. I don't know what that was supposed to accomplish. Looks like I can re-enter anytime I want. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoyed this Let's Play of Epic Battle Fantasy V, please leave a like, subscribe, and or hit the bell icon.